Okay, so today is an exciting day. I bought this totally pristine, beautiful, in a little baggie, saved. These things are expensive. I think these uh, Cosmos I got in the 1980s magazines I got were like 20 bucks each. But I'm used to paying that for um, the, uh, the European ones, so... Okay, so my first impression having sat here and looked at this, I was, so I was 20 years old when this came out. So heartbreak, poor Brooke Shields, when your man loses his job, fashion, good. Are you expecting too much or too little from him? Men who hate women, like it's all about, about the guys rather than being female focused, interesting. All right, carry lotion. And I did tell the girl who I bought this from that I was going to be destroying it. And she's excited. She wanted to see a video when I made them. Okay, so there is, who's this? Jennifer O'Neill. I don't know Jennifer. All right, our pictures are a little weird. Okay. The color is, look. This isn't from it being old. This is that, that's how much, <laughs> that's how much foundation we used to use, right? Oh, this is amazing. Okay. You're going to see lots of, eye. for you, for you gals who are used to a nude eye, I don't think that's what we're going to get. We are not going to get a nude eye here. Oh, uh, leg warmers. I loved leg warmers. Oh, there's a lot of, there was a lot of blush back in the day. Okay, whew, this is fun. Ooh, what's on the thing? On the records, the Pretenders, the Chameleons, Reba McIntyre, love her. Ooh, that's kind of a fun splash. Maybe we'll have to use that. Hmm, hmm. Oh, that's a good, kind of a good body. We may think about using that one. Virginia Slims, I smoke those. I smoke them all. Okay, whoo. What is this, Nivea? I don't need a big picture of a shoulder, I need a head. Oh my gosh, Chevy Spectrum. The height of fashion for graduates. Jelly bellies, that'll make a good border. Okay. There's some legs, but only one arm. Okay, that's... I could maybe squeak out those eyes if I need to. In 1987. Oh, we've got some big hair. This is the kind of hair I had. I had feathers and big hair. Poor David Letterman. David Letterman really just wanted to be left alone to do his job, come to work. How many of you guys did this? Order the, the, those are cassette tapes. Oh yeah, I did that. Oh, those are good eyes. Okay. And what's this one? Toyota Celica. Those were cool. Okay. Oh, this is kind of fun. We got a little dragon. Oh, we got some fun stuff for the edges. I'm going to use those on the edges. Got a bunny. Oh, I never smoked those. Amazing. Oh, but that's a good body if we need a body. Look at that. Look at how many patterns that woman is wearing. She has her striped pants. I had those. She has her jacket. Look at those shoulder pads. Those are some shoulder pads. Shoulder pads were a big deal. I don't know how old you are, but we were into shoulder pads. That's a good body, too. That's kind of a cute body. That is the hair. We used to use Aquanet, which probably is the reason the, the 80s and our hair is probably the reason for global warming because 
We used so much Aquanet. The higher the hair, the closer to God. Oh yeah. Oh, we could get a Citibank MasterCard. Now I am a little bummed. It did say that we had a, um, that there was a 70 page uh, horoscope that we didn't get. Okay, that's a good body right there. That's very clean, and I could make a big head on her. Woolite. Woolite. Do you remember when you used to use Woolite and wash all your stuff that way? Do we just not have big heads in here? Oh, bet. Bet was 41. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. This is good paper. It's not very shiny. Uh, they probably used a higher quality paper. There's our head right there. Who is that? Tracy Bregman, The Young and the Restless. Ooh, we definitely have Tracy. Let's stick this in here. So we have a head at the very least, right? Brooke Shields. God, poor thing. They sexualized her so much. Okay. Boop, boop, boop. When athletes marry, I don't know those people. Not especially athletic. Vacation on the cheap. Yeah, turn your head over and fluff it up. Oh, this is vacation wear. Nice. I feel like. That's, clothing was expensive back then, I feel like. Knits, I wore knits. Look at that. Could you imagine that sweater with these pants? Very fancy. Side swept manes. Oh my goodness, I love this. I am in love. Okay, Ooh, Caesar's Empire. I love gambling. The Stress of Sugar, that's cute. Cute illustrations, I like them. Ooh, that's kind of a fun body. Middle Class Prostitute. Ooh. Interesting. That food does not look very good, like like, I don't know that I would go, oh, yeah, I got to make that food. I think the food bloggers have, have spoiled us. We now expect food to be beautiful, delicious, recipes to be free. Those girls, that's a lot of work. Swimmies. Okay, Calban, this is speed. Like, this is actual speed. We were able to, um, the reason they can 100% guarantee it is because they used to spe sell speed. Just in case you ever wondered. Okay, so those eyes, where's our girl? Oh, those are too big for her. Okay. Because I could paint them. What are those people? Vitamins? Don't take vitamins? Creepy people. I love this paper. Okay. My parents owned a bookstore. So sometimes I know old books. Ooh, look at that. That's gorgeous. That is really pretty. I think I'm gonna have that on my side. That is cute. Okay. So, if we go, <gasps> Midori Melon. Oh, that is so good. I drank so much Midori. We lived in a different time, just so you know. We got to drink, look at how long that cigarette is. We got to drink when we were um, 18. So I had been drinking for many years. So don't 
Don't um, don't worry that I was a childhood drinker. I didn't drink very much as a child, but I smoked. Okay, so we have that fancy lady. We have this woman. I feel like we need to do something fun for her. Like get her a fun bot. Do we want to put her on this body? Would that be too weird? Okay, well we're 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 using her head somehow. Now I need a body. And we saw some cute ones. I am almost thinking to put her on like this is very normal. That would just be like to me that feels like doing a very normal thing. I do love a shoulder pad. Do we want to put her on a shoulder pad lady? I'm gonna have a shoulder pad lady. But now I feel like we need to get her a hat. What about that Midori hat? Could we do a Midori hat? Midori is um, melon liqueur and it's very good with, so I feel like we could do something with that. We're gonna do that because I love Midori. Ooh, we got some flowers. So I will tell you, I have done a couple um, now from the 90s, and it does take a hot minute to get used to um, very different images. Like, I feel like these are, okay, do we wanna put her eyes on her head? I think I do, I think I do, okay. Or I'll put her eye, oh, do we put, her eyes on her head. I don't know, I like a front facing face because I'm not um, advanced yet. I don't know when I'm gonna stop using that excuse, but I'm still using it right now, so that is just how it is. I think I want something more, something a little more. Oh, we had those, uh, what do we have? Jelly beans that I seen? There's a flower, ooh. Does that match our Midori? Okay, we'll do that. Do you know that Oneida silver is made by a cult? The Oneida cult? Very interesting. All right, let's do the M&Ms and then let's, let's leave some stuff for later. No, not M&Ms. That's a pretty leaf, jelly beans. There they are. Okay. So I'm going to get started with that. I'm going to cut all these out and I will be back. Okay. I'm working on my Cosmo January 1987. I was worried. I was a little bit worried because I was thought we might not have enough stuff. But you know me. I always worry. Do we want to do it on this craft sheet? I thought this would be a cute background for it. So let's get all our stuff. Plus, I'm feeling lazy and this one already has a background started, right? Okay, so this is what we have. We have a lady with big hair and I've cut most of her face off. We just have that tiny bit of nail. She had a fingernails. And then I have some weird eyeballs that don't quite fit her, but I love them. We have, so this, I, she's gonna be my focus. So say we turn her this way. We have a hat with a giant flower. And we could cut off part of the hat or part of the flower, right? I feel like Well, let's see, and then we have her sweater. So we don't have to have a huge sweater. This could be all hat lady. I mean, this is this is kind of a fancy Sunday go to meeting hat, to be honest with you. So if we took off just that one leaf, well, you know what I'm gonna do? Let's do this because I think <laughs> that did nothing because they're still hooked onto the top. Okay, but at least I should be able to see it. What if we do that? Then we can get her down to here and then we can just move this 
other leaf wherever we want it. But I think I like this in the Midori punch bowl. And her head and her eyes, it's gonna be like just a head lady. I love that. What do you think? I'm kind of into her head. All right, so we have these fun Okay, I know for sure what I'm gonna do with those. I am going to, so we know we have a big old head lady. I'm going to put these along the two sides to start, and I will probably be doodling those, right? Right. So when you got jelly bellies, you gotta make sure you get them into the project. There we go. Then we got this one. Doo, doo, doo. And if you don't want glue on your stuff, don't glue on your papers. Okay. And then I have kind of a um, lacy border. I just have a couple pieces of this, but that looks like that could go right there. So I'm not going to worry about that one. Let me move this up so you can see more. See more. Okay, there we go. That's good. And then we have this piece, but I could put that across the top in this area and make a top border. It's so funny, once you, once you see it, it looks white because it's kind of like a wedding, I think it's a wedding dress, I don't know. But it doesn't look white anymore once you get it next to something that's actually white, right? Then it looks more tan. Okay, so next we have, so the whole concept of this is you may never return. Enter the enchanted world, you may never return. I thought that was really cool because we have these other weird things. So I think, let's put our lady back with her head. Yeah, I can put this statue over here and feel good about that. This is kind of a fancy one it's turning into kind of a mystical one i like it let's get her down i'm going to start at the bottom and i kind of need my hands are gross so i didn't want to touch this too much or i would get it covered in bugs and it's light. Most of the time, I don't worry about it because my pictures aren't so light. All right. Now, let's put her down. Let's make a paper doll of her and hook her down. So this is her. This stem is going to go right over this. So right over the straw, just as if the stem of the flower was the straw. Get that hooked down, and then let's get this hooked down. So it's about this much of it. There we go. Let's get it flat. And then we've got this. See, I feel like I could cut off this weird white bit and hook this over here, and then I've solved my whole white stuff problem in my flower. I like it. So let's hook that down. And I like to glue my stuff together as paper doll. I call them paper dolls. As paper dolls, not on hooked onto the back, because then if I needed to, I could just cut this all back apart. Where if I have it, I've glued everything down and then been sad before. So this way, I can glue everything down. And if I need to, I can cut it all into pieces. I'm a very heavy-handed gluer today. Okay, now let's put this on her head. And I'm going to get this down as far as I can get it without looking silly. I mean, she's got a Midori. No, I want it up here. I want her to have a nice bang. She didn't spend all that time fluffing up her hair to have me covering it up with a Midori. Oh, that's cute. Okay. It's not 
Let's unstick her from the back. She's coming over here. All right, I love what's going on there. So do we want her to be, her head to be straight and her to have a jaunty flower tip? I think I do. Okay, so that's good for her. Got our little lady in the back. Okay, so then I have this sweater for her. Do I want to waste this? I guess it's not a waste. Let me think about that. Because I have a Midori neck that I could make. I almost feel like, don't you want to do that? Okay, things we have. We have little flowers, so we could put a little sprig of flower by her Midori neck. We have a bunny. I think the bunny goes somewhere else. I think the bunny's probably down there in the corner. We have a dragon, which I think for sure goes up there. I can, does he go on top? He may go on top. He definitely goes up there. We have a mysterious guy. We have a little spriggy guy. Okay, I think the mysterious guy takes away from the theme. Oh, duh. So if we just have her on a little Midori neck, I can get, okay, there we go. Whew, that was a lot of work to do something super simple, right? We put her on the Midori neck, nice and short. That goes right off the page. Okay, let's get those little guys. She's gonna be here. We can see way more of the flower. We're gonna have our dragon up, maybe even the dragons on, I think the dragons on the flower right to help cover some of that yep yep okay so i can put him for sure on the flower i love him okay here we go oh that is great that is great all right i have these flowers which i feel like Maybe come out of her head on that side. May oh, they look weird coming out of her head. So we're going to stick them down here. You can never go wrong with a little bit of flowers. All right, before I stick those down, though, let's see where we want this. Enter the enchanted world. Enter the enchanted world. Enter the... Enchanted world. Oh, this is starting to get stuck to itself. Okay, enchanted world. That's kind of cute. All right, let's get her back. Yep, you. All right, I'm just going to stick this down because that is not a feature. Hmm. I feel like if I put it over her neck, it kind of, you may never return. You may, well, I'm going to, I'm going to cut it here anyways. That just quite doesn't fit. So what if we do, you may never return. Okay, I like it down there. I like a little bit of foreboding. I'm gonna put it on top of her. So let's do our dragon tail and then kind of the top of her because I feel like this is the important part. And then we'll glue down as we go. Okay, there we go. Get our dragon stuck up in there. Okay, we gotta get his tail under control. Hold on, okay, so let me stick this down. And then let me do his tail. Okay, we're gonna start at the top of it. There we go. Whew, that was, a, that was touch and go there for a minute. Now that we have the important part stuck down, now we can go ahead and get the rest of her glued down. Perfect. Okay, so now we just have 
you may never return. I think this is going to be a super fun one. This is, this is looking a little bit like a hot mess right this second, but it is going to turn out to be one of your favorites. Before I do this, let me see if I could put this over my fingernail. I think that is way more distracting than just coloring that little bit of fingernail part. So we're gonna put this over here and say, you may never return. And I am going to doodle this and outline and I will be back. Oh my gosh, how fun did my 1980s Cosmo turn out? Um, I was super worried about her finger on her face, but as you can see, by the time we do everything around it, only you and I would ever notice that. I mean, it's a woman with a um, dragon, beautiful dragon, and Midori punch bowl head, so probably you wouldn't notice that. Um, I love all the little enchanted bits, the dragon and the bunny and this little guy over here. Her eyes turned out real cute. If you saw another one of my videos, I had flipped through and she looked bad in the middle. Um, I can't remember if I showed you the middle. Um, but all in all, I love how it came out and I'm digging the big hair. I did a little extra bit with the gold in here. Um, but I'm digging the big hair of the 1980s girls. So hopefully that helps. Tara Jacobson, artsy fartsy life.